What is style input type? Style input type is type that you use to create input field where you can enter only valid telephone numbers. Valid telephone numbers are all numbers that follow pattern that we set with the pattern HTML attribute. All about pattern HTML attribute we will learn in the next lesson. Okay, let's create new input element. Let's define type and name HTML attributes. For type, let's set tell. A name will be tell field. Let's define label for our input element. So basically, we'll create input field where you can enter telephone numbers. So if we refresh our web page, now we can see we have input tell type where you can enter for now anything. So if we try to submit our form, okay, we need to enter email address here. So if we try to submit our HTML form now, we will successfully submit this form to data processing action script that we have set. But with pattern HTML attribute that we can use on tell, we can set that inside of this input field you can enter only telephone numbers in some format. For example, let's set something like this. We can enter three values that need to be digits from 0 to 9, so something like 1, 2, 3, or 3, 3, 3, or anything like that, then their sign, then once again, three digits from 0 to 9. And once again, dash sign and three digits from 0 to 9. Okay. And let's set required HTML attributes so user need to enter some value in this tell input field. So if we go back in our web browser and refresh our page, we just need to enter some new lines after our tell input field. Okay, so let's save this change. And when you refresh our page, okay. So now if we enter, let's populate our email first. If we enter something like 1231231123, we will get validation error that need to follow requested format. So our format is three digits, dash sign, three digits, dash sign, and three digits. So basically if we set dash sign after first three digits and after second three digits we will follow requested format that we have in our pattern HTML attribute. So if we try to submit this, we can again submit this to our data processing action script. So basically this is how tell input field work. So we need to use pattern HTML attribute with it. Thanks for watching this tutorial and I hope this was helpful to you. If you like our work, please become our Patreon or simply donate our PayPal. Please remember, even a little from you means a lot for us. You can follow us on our Twitter and Instagram profiles and please don't forget to subscribe on our YouTube channel because on our YouTube channel, knowledge is waiting for you.